video. This is a continuation of my last video. How to make popsicles out of an ice tray. <clears throat> so make sure you like this video. Hit subscribe down below. And hit that other notification button to get notified of my videos. So today we're going to be doing the continuation of that. So, so anyway, what you want to do is first you gotta take your aluminum foil off. I've already did that. It's over here. Make sure you throw your aluminum foil away when you get done with it. And here is the popsicles. Go like this, twist it that way, twist it that way to get them blow close. And you have a beautiful popsicle. The reason mine is blue is because I use blue Kool-Aid. But you can use any beverage you want. And when you lick on it, it tastes just like the beverage that you put in it. So, let's take our first lick, shall we? Mmm, it's so good. Okay, you can use these for any time. Any time. You can use them for a pool party. You can use them for a slumber party. You can use them... Whenever you just want a sweet treat. So, when you get done with it, make sure you throw your toothpick away. And, when you're not done with it, put it back in the ice cube tray. And you have 16 beautiful ice popsicles for your friends and family to enjoy. And when you get out of them, make sure to rinse this out. Make sure there's no leftover beverage in there. And then you can take another one of your favorite beverages and just do it again. See, this is what I love about ice cube trays is that they clean really easily and you can do without just about any beverage in here. So, and when you get done with them, make sure to put them back in the freezer. That way they do not melt. Okay? So, that is all for me today from this video. If you liked it, please smash that thumbs up button. Sm also, Smash the subscribe button and the notification bell to get notified of when I post new videos. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.